Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. On today's video, I'm gonna be taking you through our morning routine. Um, first thing I like to do with everybody is take them out on a quick little walk. Um, we'll see how far we get because I have three dogs with me now. So yeah, that's the first thing we're gonna do. back from our walk. Are you guys ready to go inside? Yeah? Peach, inside. Good. Come on. Come. Sit. Hey guys, so we're back inside and um, the dogs already ate, but I still need to go and feed the chickens. So that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm just gonna go ahead and get um, their food ready. They usually just have chicken feed, but I have mm, one broody chicken that is not really wanting to come out of her um, nest. So I actually have to take her out and then close the house um, or you know their little coop. So um, I'm gonna add some apples to incentivize her to come out um, because she's just very pretty. <laughs> so yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. Oh, good boy. So I've been doing this thing with Dante. He He's a counter surfer, okay? Let's just put that out there. I've been teaching him that when I am cooking, he needs to either be sitting or down. And if he is able to maintain that position um, the entire time, then I'll give him a treat after I'm done cooking. All right, so yeah, I'll take Peach with me because she is um, pretty good with the chickens. Dante, he doesn't really mind them anymore, um, but I don't really trust him to have the chickens walking around him. And then if one of them runs, I feel like he'll his prey drive will definitely kick in. Um, it's definitely not like before that it was like he could not even like hear them. Um, but I just you know I'm not gonna he's not the dog for chicken feeding. Peach is the dog for chicken feeding. And Leroy, um, Leroy, he's like okay with the chickens. Um, but I'm gonna be dunking one of the chickens and he gets very curious about that, so I'm not gonna be taking him. And now you're probably wondering what dunking means. Um, I'll show you guys when we go outside. Uh, 
Um, so the reason that I'm going to dunk one of the chickens in cold water is because I read online that that kind of helps them snap out of their broodiness. So if you guys want to go ahead and read up more about that, fine. I had one chicken that was broody. I dunked her, obviously not like on a cold day, dunk her in cold water. Um, but I dunked her and she stopped. She got like snapped out of it. So you'll see that she doesn't want to come out of her nest. So I have to come and take her out in the morning and then close her house. Oh, there she is. And she's been um, not using her nesting box because one of the other chickens was starting to be broody, like I explained. So then they kind of just like, okay, fine. None of us are going to go in the nesting box and none of them are going. So I got to kick her out of there. Girl. Oh, she already knows. Look at her. Oh, she's such a good girl. Two more eggs. So dramatic. Yeah, that will be the end of this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed spending the morning with us. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more content like this, as well as um, don't forget to check out our memberships that are currently active so that you can get access to videos uh, a little bit earlier, as well as seeing some behind the scenes content. Um, speaking of our memberships, um, special shout out to Amor Furland. I might be butchering that subscriber name. Thank you so much for becoming a member of our channel. We really appreciate you. And yeah, thank you so much. Don't forget to check out the courses over at Fenrir um, if you need, you know, some help with um, your dog and just building on your relationship with them. I really recommend those courses. So thank you to everybody who watched. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And we'll see you. Until next time. Bye, guys.